Good day, everybody. My name is Ms. Maboy. I welcome you to today's grade 10 business studies lessons. And for today's lesson, we'll be focusing on the topic business plan, pastel and components and the components of a business plan, basically, for um, our topic. So it says here, did you know riches do not come by crossing fingers and walking through the day hoping? But riches and wealth comes from well-laid plans. Mm, this is by Jim Ron, talking about planning. To, so, to say, as a person, you need to plan in order for you to basically um, achieve your objectives. So by the end of this lesson, you should be able to explain the importance of a business plan. You should be able to explain the challenges of the macro environment on a business using the personal analysis. Now you remember macro was one of the topics that we did in like the beginning of the year as a business studies topic, there's macro environment. Name or state the components of a business plan. All right, so this is our journey for today or our map. So we are looking at the importance or we'll be looking at the importance of a business plan. Why is a business plan important? Then we'll be looking at the challenges of the macro environment. And then lastly, we'll be looking at the components of a business plan. What does the business plan comprise of? All right, but obviously, before you understand the meaning, I mean, rather the importance of a business plan, one needs to be able to explain a business plan, and you should know what a business plan is all about. Hence, this is our pre-knowledge. You are expected to know the meaning of a business plan. So what is it? How would you explain a business plan before you are able to tell the importance of it? How would you define it? It says here, a business plan is a written description of a prospective business, meaning this is a business that you'd want to venture into. So you cannot just start venturing into a business without having a written description of it. It explains how the prospective business owner will obtain the funding. Where does the money come from to continue with your business or to start your business? It also describes how the business will deal with threats and market its own goods. All right, so these are the new words that we will be um, finding or coming across in this topic. Business plan, uh, a document that outlines the important facts, the processes and the procedures of the business. So basically, this is the gist of our topic, business plan, or of our lesson for today, rather. We've got executive summary, which is a summary of the entire business plan. Vision is a long-term future goal of the business. Mission statement, the activities the business will do in order to achieve its goals. What is it that we're going to do to achieve our goals? Legal requirements, these are legal documentation such as licenses, permits, and tax regulations that must be complied with before the business can start operating. So before you start operating, there are certain legislations or legal documents that one needs to comply with. All right, another term is a marketing plan which is a strategy or plan of how the business is going to sell its product or service. Basically, how will you get your product to be well known or to be known out there? Lastly, we've got a market research, which is the action of gathering information about consumers' needs and preferences. What is it that the customers would like to buy and, and all that? All right, uh, so now we're going to go on to a quick break. When we come back, we need to come back energized so that we start with the journey for today's lessons. I'll see you just now.